Guys, it's time to get up. Yeah. We're gonna go home today. Yeah. We've been in the hospital for so long, it's gonna be nice to go home. Yeah, I know. <sighs> I'm so tired. Let's you, go home. Well, you just had a pregnancy, Mom. Two, actually. Yeah. I have four. <clears throat> four children. I thought that we'd only get three. We have four. Yeah. That means more pranks in the middle of the night. After this, I don't think I'm in the mood to do any pranks for the rest of my life. Good. Um, okay, we're gonna check out now. Oh, you're not gonna stay um, any more time at the hospital? Because after uh, um, twins, it's good to stay for two weeks. We've been here for four days. I think that we're good. <laughs> you know, all the tumors, the Lyme disease, the two pregnancies. I think we're good. So, well, thanks for your time, doctor. Um, and, uh, yeah, we'll go home now. Okay, bye. <sighs> okay, everyone get in the car. We don't have enough space. We're gonna have to get a bigger car. So I'm gonna put them in the back. Okay, just put them in the back. Dad has been extremely nice to us lately. It's probably because we have Lyme disease. Probably because of all the pregnancies. But he's really mean to us again. Yeah. So let's act sick. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't feel good. Are you guys just trying to get on my good side? You do this all the time. Maybe. At least twice a week. Dad, don't start. Okay. Yeah, honey, you've been so good with the kids and everything. Just stop. I think that I'm about to go back to my old habits. Stop now. Okay, let's go. Uh, wait, I'm not buckled. Okay, there. Yeah, I'm going home. Yay, finally. We haven't been here in a while, guys. We're finally home. Yeah, I know. Get you out? I can't. I go to my hockey tournament. You're not going to that hockey tournament. Ugh. Get inside. Uh, boys, what are you doing? He wants to go to a hockey tournament. You're going. I'll drive you there. Hey, leave me alone. Get off of his back. Hey, but just... I'm just trying to resolve our issues. By punching him? Hey, if he would agree to not go to hockey anymore, there would be no need for that. You keep on forcing me to not go. Honey, what do you have to say to about this? Me? Yeah. I think that dad is being unfair. Ugh, just everyone get in the house. I have to make dinner. Dinner, dinner, dinner. I'm making dinner. <sighs> Thank God. Careful with that baby. Two. If someone gives you me a hand get putting them up the stairs, then maybe... Here, let me be your guide. Oh, okay. And then roll them into the house. You're coming with me. Come here. Let's go. Kids, go inside. Okay. What the heck do you think you're doing? I'm just trying to give a helping hand. Mom! Mom! The babies, they flipped over because Dad. I didn't do anything. I tried Can to you help. touch them? Yeah. They're everywhere. You just threw our babies. Don't mind if I do, but... Hey, leave me alone, woman. You, you were totally irresponsible. I think that you should just... If you want to drive and relax, I think you've been cooped up in that hospital for too long. You, I, you were so too nice. Too much free food. You've been so nice to the kids in the hospital. Why can't you just stay like that? Because that's the way I am. <laughs> get, get inside! Okay, this is really good, Mom. It'd be better with Dad, though. I wonder where he is. He's driving, like I said him. Well, can you call him and make him come back? No, I don't want him to come back. Why? Because he's being completely obnoxious and being rude to all of you. No, he's been nice. Only at the hospital. He's, he was so nice. That's the nicest we've ever known him. Even you. Kids, go upstairs. Okay. I'll be back. You too. That's so hard. It was, like, so nice when Dad was nice to us. Yeah, I know. It's like, I'm sad that it's gone. Yeah, me too. <sighs> I gotta go to bed. Kids, bed! Bed! We're going to bed. Let's go to bed.